Hey there, how's it going? Are you good? Brilliant! So today what I have for you in this video is me, my hand, making some food. I'm gonna make some food to eat because I am hungry. So before I get started, what I'm gonna do blah, 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 blah. is tell that guy to go home. And now he's gone. I can eat in peace. Eat in peace. Well, I still have the cats and you will see the cats right now. And here we have the crazies. What? Crazy number one, the original crazy, and crazy number two. Together, they make me crazy. Okay, so I'm gonna assume you know what a grill is. This is a grill. This is a grill. These are grills. No, seriously. This grill in particular is the one that I'm talking about. What is that? It's a George Foreman grill. And this is George Foreman. And this is George Foreman with some grills. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna be starting off with this. And this is some streaky bacon. Nice. And there were 16 in this, but there are now eight. So uh, yeah, these are from, where are they from? Tesco. Tesco is a shop. So these will get done in around five minutes. And then I'm gonna move on to these things, eight unsmoked turkey rashers. And these are from Tesco. Tesco is a shop. Nice. So these will only take a couple of minutes to do. Well, let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna take these out and put them on the grill like this. One, I think I'll just use four of these and then maybe two of the others. Turn the grill on first. So I'm gonna put them horizontally first. That way they'll shrink and then I'll put them vertically and then all the oil and grease and stuff will drip into the pan. They are coming along nicely. Don't know why I was pointing at them. And now I'm gonna turn them over using a spoon and a fork. But I saw. And to be honest, they don't even need turning over. Okay, so while they're getting done, I'm gonna take these out. I'll just take two of them out. That is, if I can get it open. And Peanut is hovering around my feet. Literally hovering. And I think these are just about done now. Okay, so I've put these to one side. And now I'm gonna put two of these on here. And now to try to turn these over. These only take a couple of minutes. Awesome. Okay, so that is these sorted. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these into a sandwich. After I spray this down. And that is just a bit of water. That'll just help loosen up all the burnt stuff when it comes to cleaning it. And then this stuff in here is gonna go in the bin because if you put this down the drain, eventually you'll block it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do with all this, obviously I'm gonna eat it, but how am I gonna eat it? Well, with my mouth. No, I'm gonna put it into some bread. This is bread. You're joking. And what I would normally do is toast it, butter it, and then put these in between and um, go to town on it. But what I'm gonna do this time is, um, Actually, I think I'll stick with my original plan and toast them. Um, this is the butter I'm gonna be using. What I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna take the toast out and scrape it along this, or scrape this along that. You're pulling my plonker now, aren't you? Right, the toast is now done. So, toast and butter. And scrape it along like this. It's so hard to actually see what, what's happening. Done. So now what I'm going to do is just go like this. That's just so weird. And um, this way around. And there we go, that's sorted. Bit of butter. And I'll put this into this plate. And now I'm just going to clean my hands after putting back the butter. 
So I put the butter back without buttering the other toast. Right, anyway, now what I think I'll do is use this ketchup. Might as well just bang some ketchup on this. And that should be good enough. So then grab the other toast, the other unbuttered toast, and put it on like a saw. Now what I'll do is, I'll eat it. And you can watch the cats as I eat this. Their reactions are often quite entertaining. Okay, so there are the cats, and what I'll do is I'll just sit on this stool and eat in front of them. By the way, this tastes pretty good. So pancakes, not bothered. Okay, so it's been a few hours and I'm hungry again. Rubbish, it's the next day. What the hell? Is there somebody in that room? Okay, never mind. Okay, so older subscribers will have seen me do this before and they will have also seen me make boiled eggs before. I don't think you can actually cook. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a egg sandwich. Egg sandwich, like I've done before, like I said, like I've done before. So if you're a vegan, um, what are you doing watching this video? If you're a vegetarian, however, what are you doing watching this video? Happy hens lay tasty eggs. So if you're a chicken, then what are you doing watching this video? Why am I talking to a chicken? You don't understand what I'm saying. Here we have eight eggs, eight eggs. And um, yes. And here we have a pan. Yes, that's a pan. Not a pot, like somebody said in one of my older videos. A pot has two handles. By the way, I learned that when I was four. The pan is now filled with water. If you can't see the water, Whoa. there you go, there's water. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the eggs into here. Like a saw. And then I'm gonna turn it on by pressing this button down here. Now I'm gonna leave these on to boil for 10 minutes, but check this out. There we go, it's boiling. And now what I'll do is I'll just leave it for another minute and uh, then turn it off and then leave it for 10 minutes again. Okay, so these are done now. Uh, what I'm gonna do next is peel these bad boys. Did I just call these bad boys? Yes, I did. Like a saw. And then I'm gonna put them in here. That is a bowl. Let's move this over to here and... And then peeling them is a piece of cake. So you just go like this and... Then they're done. Right, so next what I'm gonna do is just chop these up. Slice them. I like a so. And by the way, these eggs, yeah, the yolks on these because they're happy. You see how colorful they are? You see how nice and like yellowy orange they are compared to how pale some of them can be. And that is the reason we get these eggs. Right, now what I'm gonna do is add some of this salad cream so that's gonna go like so not too much and not too little don't need the knife anymore just gonna go like this mush them all up mush them all up and then before my battery dies not my battery the camera's battery quick taste test that is good i'm gonna put a slice of bread onto this plate that's not really a plate there we go, that's more like it. So now I'm just gonna scoop this out and put it on here. Put it on here. Put it on here. And there we go, that's sorted. Now I'm just gonna spread this out a little bit more. Put this one on top. That's it, sorted. Now I'm gonna eat. And that right there is how you make quick food. Because obviously you've got things to do and you, you know, you don't want to be sitting around eating, preparing food and going out to eat and all that bollocks. No, you're a busy person. You want to do stuff with your time. You don't want to waste your time. So yeah, that's all from me for now. And I'll see you next time. Oh yeah, a bit of artificial sweetener. Ciao.